Well, hello there, YouTube. It's Hair BMW, and uh, just happened to have this beautiful sunset going on here tonight, and I thought I'd let y'all in on it. It's gorgeous out over the river. So, this is just a little bit of an update. <clears throat> oh, look at that. That looks pretty cool. You can see the red on the E90 from the sky. Looks pretty good. Looks pretty good. I don't know if I've shown everybody here lately, but the uh, blacked out trim all the way around the window, all that, it's all blacked out now. Looks good. I'm loving it. <clears throat> loving it, loving it, loving it. Just here catching up on some videos. And I also got a new surprise today. I uh, I'm gonna show you all my dun da da da. Look at that. Got my own stickers now. My own logo, combining my two favorite things in the world, my BMW and my Apple. And that's my, in case you didn't know, my YouTube name or handle or whatever you call it. So, I have to tell you that I literally called yesterday morning. I called these fellows here in my little hometown and uh, asked them if they made decals. Because I've been, my wife told me to try Etsy, this internet Etsy thing. Well, that was a bust. So I called the guy. Well, actually, I emailed him. And I said, you know, do you all make um, decals? And he says, well, send me a design. So, literally, that's the really crappy handmade sketch that I had. And then I had a couple of these just little pictures that I cut out. And I sent them to him. And I thought, in my mind, you know, days, whatever. I Maybe I'll hear, maybe I won't. Within 30 minutes, man calls me back and says, what do you think of this? And he had a design. And, um, and he, had, uh, he had kind of a script text. And I said, well, I don't really like the script text. Can you make the text sort of like the BMW text? He says, well, give me a few minutes. Literally, 20 minutes later, he sends this back. He says, I can have them for you in an hour. I'm like, what? What? Are you serious? So there you go. Literally, at 7.30 in the morning, I sent the email. And by lunch, I picked them up. And they're seven-year exterior vinyl. So, you know, they ought to hold up. But I think it's just gorgeous. I swear. It's just amazing. So anyway... If you guys are ever looking to have your signs, you know, decals or whatever made, these are the guys right here. Little old Newburn, North Carolina. And uh, I asked him if I could put his uh, his name on there. It's three guys designs at yahoo.com. Th uh, three guys signs at yahoo.com. Anyway, and he mails, he does all that stuff. So, um... Man, I'll tell you, I couldn't be more impressed. Had no earthly idea. I thought it was going to take days or weeks. Because the stupid Etsy thing, you know, you email them and take two or three days. And every time you talk with them, they're like, well, you know, I can't really do the design. If you send me the design, I'll see if I can recreate it. And like, well, if I could design it, I wouldn't be asking you to do it. So, anyway. That's neither here nor there. <clears throat> so, um... The first one I got, uh, the first one I have, I'm going to send off to uh, to John Kerry 1963 Jag because I have to, uh, in the spirit of full disclosure, um, the very first video that I saw that I thought, oh, that's really cool. That guy is doing something interesting and is interesting to listen to and knows what he's talking about. It happened to be John Kerry 1963 Jag 
and he was in the process of rebuilding the rear differential in the Jag. And I, I, I remember distinctly that somewhere along the line he, he made a mistake in the way he was putting it together. And he had a little note in there in text that he then went on and showed how he had to take it all apart and redo it. And I thought, now that is a real guy working in his garage. And there's something to be uh, learned from that. And so I watched his videos and that's when I saw him do a mail call and I thought, well, that's very cool, these guys. Uh, not only are they sharing the, you know, the decals, which in and of itself is cool, but that led me to look at their sites because I would look at, you know, his favorites and things like that and I would visit other sites and now, you know, now I've got Dan Electro and Cutworm and Yahooban. I mean, I've I, so many, I've got like 40 people that I've got on my on my uh, subscription list so I'm I'm looking at them all enjoying it learning and um, thinking about getting involved in a pretty big project myself and I wouldn't think about doing it wouldn't have thought about doing it before um, watching the video so um, that's about it it's a beautiful night here in the garage and uh, I just wanted to uh, <clears throat> turn you all around. I just wanted to brag a little about my uh, my new stickers. I think they're very cool. I, I haven't seen anybody else had one like that, so I guess that's a good thing. So it's six and a half minutes, and uh, I just thought I'd give you all a quick update, and uh, 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 very interesting. I got a comment. Someone, no someone had noticed uh, John Wayne, uh, and I will accept no disparaging remarks about John Wayne. Uh, someone noticed my John Wayne and uh, asked me why in the world that I have that. Well, that's not exactly what they asked me, but um, and I said that you know the sun rises and sets on John Wayne. If it's going to be a movie and it hasn't got John Wayne in it, the best it can be is a second-rate movie, in my opinion. But Anyway, <clears throat> I guess it's too dark over there to see, but uh, so uh, he and I uh, commented back and forth a little bit and I threw a John Wayne is a madam and I asked him in no uh, uncertain terms if he was so smart about John Wayne he ought to know that quote and uh, so he said... Uh, well, what you need to do is you need to put a quote out there every once in a while and see if I can get it. So I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that. Um, I won't say I know them all, but I sure know a few of them. So we'll see. Anyway, I think that's about it, YouTube fans. I've yacked on long enough. I'm just gonna post this and try and get in the habit of doing a little bit of an update, even when I don't have a project going. All those speaking of projects. I was in the process, as you can see right there, doing my pricing. The next project on the E9330i is going to be um, plugs and coil packs and uh, serpentine belt, tensioner, and um, what is it called? Uh, deflection pulley. So. Uh, that's the next project. I was going to try and do the whole front end radiator flush and water pump thermostat, but whew, that was about $800. So that's going to have to wait. And uh, most of that expense is in the water pump, which is an electric water pump. <laughs> Who knew? And unlike my Z3, where the uh, thermostat was very easy to get to up on the top of the engine. This one is all the way down underneath. And um, I still I still haven't gotten my mess right. Um, and with my, as you all know, my garage is, uh, well again, it's, it's too dang dark. I only have the light on over the bench here. But anyway, um, uh, oh, 
the um, can't get my floor jack under the car. The car's too low. So um, I'm going to get with my dad, who's got a pickup truck, and we're going to go over in his garage, and we're going to take some two by tens or two by twelves and <clears throat> cut them, taper them, so I can get the car up high enough to get the floor jack under. And uh, you know that's a good thing. I ought to ask: Has anybody ever heard of or used a deal called EZ Car Lift? In fact, I'll show you right there. EZ Car Lift. Because I came across that thing, and daggone if I don't think it's a pretty cool-looking deal for a home mechanic like me, especially if I decide to do this other um, other project I'm thinking about. Um, but if any of you have that or any of you aware of that I would sure like to know because um, it's not cheap but then again it's a tool so it, it ain't going to be cheap but I'd be curious to know if any of you have come across that so that's it um, yeah <laughs> as Dan Electro would say you know, I, I was done 10 minutes ago and now I'm still talking so uh, <clears throat> It's going to be 12 minutes before it's all said and done, so I'll wrap it up there. YouTube, it's Hair, H E R R, Hair BMW on the YouTube. And uh, I hope you'll check out my videos. And um, if you like them, like them. And if you will, subscribe. All right, bye.